Ah, oh, fuck is this shit? Is that yours? Of course not. I have only got myself to blame for the mess these kids are in. You are either drunk, or you're staring miserably at the clouds, or you're out there doing God only knows what. Oh, yeah. I done horrible by you. Pulled you out of a Midwestern trailer park, got you a big mansion in Rockford Hills. Hell, the only thing you gotta worry about anymore is what part of your body you wanna have chopped off or sucked out again. Screw you, Michael. Ah, but you won't. I was faithful to you up until I found you in a stripper. <laughs> I would divorce your ass if I could. You are nothing but a murdering, cheating hypocrite. Thank you, Michael, whatever the fuck our fake last name is. You have ruined my serenity yet again. My yoga is fucked. Oh, is that what they're calling it now? You and your fucking yoga. Did someone say yoga? Oh, hello, baby, darling. Namaste. Namaste. You must be Mikhail. Namaste. Hmm. Nah, Michael, fuck yourself. Michael! You've got to work on your anger, brother. It's killing you. Yeah, tell me about it. Ah! There you are, you little shit. Are you looking for this? Ah, 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 ah. Dude, very funny. You know, you're a real asshole. What did you just fucking say to me? Stop it! You two, you're ruining my fucking yoga! Somebody say yoga? <gasps> Trevor? Michael. Hey. <laughs> it's good to see you, man. Mm, yeah, I bet it is. Of course, I'm not the one that's been resurrected. Ain't this grand, huh? Yeah, well. I got in a bit of an awkward situation. Mm, you're telling me, bro. Yeah. One of those... Fake your own deaths to your best buddy, and then run off with the dough, and then live in the big mansion. Awkward situations. It's one way of looking at it. Yeah, do you have any other ways of looking at it? Because I am all out. It was a long time ago, man. I've been in witness protection. I still am. That's great. That's great. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Where are my manners, right? <laughs> Amanda, it is good to see you. Oh, I missed you. You used to be fatter. <laughs> nice new tits, by the way. Jimmy, you, you used to be thinner. But, yeah, uh, can't blame you. Who are you? Namaste. I'm Fabian. Uh. Good lord. Where's Tracy? Where's your sister, Jim? Um, she, she's, a, uh, she's, a, uh, she's trying out for TV. She's what? Yeah, she's auditioning for Fame or Shame. Fame or Shame? What the fuck are you talking about? You know, it's that talent slash skills show. She loves it, you guys know that. What's her talent? Dancing. Oh, Christ, she's a horrible dancer. Michael! Come. She might disagree with you on that. Jesus Christ, what, now? Now? Where? Um, the Maze Bank Arena. Oh, little Tracy being humiliated. Let's go, we go get her. We? Yeah, we, what, are you gonna stand here and argue while your daughter becomes a national laughing stock? Huh? You're worse than I thought. Now let's go, come on! So, Mike, what were you doing? I was making myself a juice. Broccoli, raw kale, fish oil. Broccoli, raw kale, fish oil. This recipe I got is packed with nutrients, fibers, vitamins, and it don't taste bad. I'll send you the recipe. Anyway, get this. I'm making it. The blender slips, juice goes everywhere. I'm about to clean it up when I find this bag of grass. Big fucking bag, Jimmy's, right? Okay, just that moment, Amanda comes in, sees me there with I didn't ask for a blow-by-blow blow of how you lost your last ounce of masculine pride. I wanted to know what you've been doing for a decade. 
Easy, T. Don't T me. Hey, if anyone needs kill, my friend. I'm beyond pale, okay? It's too late for pale. And it's magical powers to have any effect on me. Fine. Or yoga. Or cock therapy. I'm a crank, cannibalist, an incest kind of guy. Let's skip that talk and go straight to shock treatment with your ass. You two chilled out to say my name? Fat slob. You two relaxed and you laid back Los Santos embarrassment? Huh? Is one letter all you can bring yourself to wrap your slothful lips around? Whoa, dude. You do not let the fuck up. I got ten years worth of venting to do. The let up, my friend, is a long way off. What the fuck you want? Want? Well, I, I want to save your daughter from making an ass of herself. Oh, really, man? Really? What is it? Money or a fight? What? What are you coming here looking for? I came looking. Hey. I don't care. Let's find your baby. You can't park there. Production vehicles only. <laughs> Come on, Sir, you dipshit. Ah, that host, man, he's like any closet TV presenter, bitter as fucking vinegar. Where the fuck are they? Hello, sir, may I please have your name? Where the fuck is Tracy Townley, huh? Tracy fucking DeSanta, fuck, screw this! Where the fuck's Laszlo? It doesn't matter. It is quiet, shh. It's good, then, as I've been. All right. Yeah. That was really... <laughs> All right, it's the auditions, Fame or Shame, season 14, right here in Vinewood, San Andreas. Coming up next, it's Tracy DeSanta. Judges, Tracy DeSanta. Yes. <laughs> Hi. All right, Tracy's a dancer, but she also likes acting, modeling. Tracy! Go home! All the Come back go. here! Forthville. Tell me you don't want to slap him as bad as I do! They took our ride, we take their truck. There! We take the truck! Hey! We're running that trip down. Look, you went left. The trailer was slowing us down. Boom! How can you sit there and watch your daughter get treated like that? Hey, you raise a daughter in this town, you get used to stunts. It's poor parenting. Now, yeah, thanks for the fun. Feedback. It means a lot coming from you. No one's getting in the way of the big rig! We'll flatten this dick bag. Fucking last one. I knew he was an asshole. Just push him off the fucking road! It's only a battery car. Come on! This ain't exactly a race. We gotta go. We can have a little fun with it. But let's not try to kill this prick, all right? When we crush his little boy car, who knows what'll happen to him? He took a left. I knew this city would be full of douchebags. Can we speed it up a little, huh? Maybe by throwing your fat carcass over the side. Go 
out to the right. Can't get enough of the celebrities, can you? Ten fucking minutes at LS. Shut up! That cocksucker might be famous, but oh. We'll get him! We'll get him! But well, we're sure taking our time about it. Ha ah, ah, ha! He's going down into the LS River. I can see that. I hate that closeted man whore on the TV. I hate him on the radio. I told those ass hats. I hate him even more in person. He was never funny. I've never even seen him before. Oh, you have, believe me. The little shit's all out of juice. Oh, hey, 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 guys. You run out of batteries, huh? I didn't mean anything by it, all right? Oh, yeah? Well, that little girl sat on my lap when she was two years old, and I swore to God that I would rip the fucking skin off anyone who fucking wronged her. Look, I'm just a dumb A-list celebrity trying to entertain America, okay? I got a lot of stuff going on right now, dude, besides you trying to kill me. Now I got multiple sexual harassment lawsuits, plus I'm an addict, all right? And I've relapsed. I can't stop jacking, dude. I jack it in traffic. What's your talent, uh, huh? I mean, aside from love and sex. Dude, haven't you seen my show? It's not live, it's not funny. That's my genius, I got no fucking talent. You clearly ain't being humble, T. Uh, you proved your point. Uh, this is your daughter. You should be wanting to rip the fucking ponytail off the back of this guy's head! And you! Huh? Pants off. Uh, oh, 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 oh. Uh, okay. There you go. Uh, uh, All right. What are you doing? Now, I want you to dance sexy, celebrity, mm hmm? I mean, I need music, or... Are you trying to fucking annoy me, huh? I'll, I'll dance. Good. <laughs> All right, all right, now drop it like it's hot, all right? I want to see you get nice and low. Get a cab here as soon as possible. On its way, sir. Thanks for calling. Okay, thanks for your help. Hey, Lester. Mike, hey, uh, I'm transferring your cut of the jewel store take to your account. Madrazo's already got the house money, so you can rest easy there. <laughs> ah, thank God for that. Pinewood Hills. Let's go! Buckle up! Exactly. Just breathe through it. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa. Get out of that. Ah. Shit. Sorry, man. This is the limit.
Let's go, now! Davy, how you doing? About as good as can be expected, but the news is not good. I don't know what you're talking about. I know you did that fucking jewelry job. Davy, seriously, you're imagining things. Fuck you. All right. I did it. Arrest me. You know what? You'll be saving my life. Because you called it, motherfucker. What? You called it. Trevor. A couple days ago. But we haven't really talked about anything either. But if the when he starts asking questions about why you're not feeding worms south of the Canadian border. Oh, we got problems. Yeah, no shit. <sighs> We're in it. Together. So, if your problems are my problems, then I guess that means that my problems are sort of your problems. <laughs> uh-uh. Nope. What if I lose my job? Someone comes into my office, starts reading my files. They'll see the things I did. I know a lot of stuff. I can cop a plea, get five years, but you... Fuck you, you ungrateful prick. I made your career. Well... And we better go about saving it together, because you and I both know we can't let it go to shit now. What do you need? This guy. Ferdinand Karamov. The agency claims he's dead. We at the Bureau think they're full of crap. We think he's being debriefed someplace. So? Apparently. He has information which will put me and my superiors out of circulation. Those agency fuckers have got the coroner's office locked down. We need you to verify the body. So how the hell am I gonna get in here? Well, you've played dead before, haven't you? I have always kind of liked you. Call me when you wake up. I'll tell you what to do. What we got? Uh, John Doe, white male, overweight, in his late 40s, possible coroner. Let's take a peek. The fat deposits on his hips and abdomen suggest a fondness for bleeder burgers. What the hell was that? Don't worry, it's just gas. No, no, it's reanimating. You want to cut it in the coroner's office, you're going to have to lose the nerves. I've been around cadavers. This isn't right. Ah! Oh, Jesus. Ah! Back from the dead, ah! motherfucker. Ah! 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 Come out. Hands in the air. Come on. Might be in the other room. Come on. You wanna end? That don't look right. Guess you can't judge a corpse by its toe tag. I found the toe tag. Ferdinand Karamov. 
It's on some big black lady. Definitely not your guy. Okay. The agency have the lower floors on lockdown to prevent a leak. I got a guy who can cut the power to give you some help, but you'll have to get upstairs if you're gonna get out. You! We got an injury. It's Stavely. Stavely's hit. Take cover! Oh. Containment! Containment! This is fucked!
Hey, Mike. Yeah. Hey, we need to talk. Quick. Meet me at those oil derricks just outside town, El Burro Heights. And make sure you're not tailed. Man, that don't sound too good, homie. Look, I'm on my way. Hey, Franklin. What's going on? You gotta get out of town. Man, I ain't exactly got nowhere to go. Well, then take a trip. A long trip. What the fuck is going on? Things, all right? Look, you remember I told you I know people, feds, who looked after me when I retired? You did? Yeah, I did. I mean, I think I did. I Hello. Yeah, can you send out a cab to me? No problem. I'll have one there in a couple of minutes. Sounds good, thanks. Where do you want to go? Come on! Okay, buddy. There you go. What is wrong with you smoking in my house? You know, ever since that psychotic pal of yours turned up, you've turned into an even bigger asshole. Thank you. Your support in my difficult times means the world to me. I've supported you. I left everything to come here with you, and still, that crazy bastard turns up. I'll handle it. How? I don't know. Oh, you know what? Just keep him away from me and the children, you low-life, whoremongering asswipe. Did someone say yoga? No, I think she said whore monitoring asswipe. Hello, Fabian, darling. <laughs> Namaste, Amanda. Are we ready to practice? Yes. Oh, yeah, she's very centered. A regular you oasis see what I of live peace with? and tranquility, this with one. Anger issues and worse friends. No you... wonder I'm so upset. You too, please. Namaste. We practice. Miguel, join us, please. No, please, no. No, please. No. The yoga is for sharing. Come, come, Miguel, come. Awesome. So, Fab, if you can make me as happy and mellow as my wife, it'll be a job well fucking done. We are all on our own journeys, Miguel. Yeah, no doubt. So why is she driving a tank on hers? Perhaps to deal with your hostility, Michael. Now here is good. We have the sun and the moribunda. The asshole. Now we begin to put the asshole to the earth. Yes, we begin each sequence. Katasana. Yes. Or mountain pose. All right. Un, deux, trois. If mouth and anus are perfectly in line. Show him, Amanda. Un, deux, trois. It is perfect. Now, Michael. I don't know about this. Now, in through the bloated nose and out through those wrinkled lips. Very good. Now let it go. Maintain it. In and out with the breath, Michael. It moves. 
Amazing. Air through the nose and out the mouth. <sighs> Who would have thought it possible? This is gonna have to do. Now we will do something more complicated. Sometimes when I do this pose, I weep uncontrollably for hours. Feel that the emotion inside. Let it go. <laughs> Michael, join us. I feel like I'm channeling bullshit right now. Breathe, Mikkel. Let it out, baby. Later you can show a stripper how flexible you are. Now, you breathe. Keep this up, and we might actually have a shared interest. You can breathe, can't you? Out through those wrinkled lips. Keep it tight. The silly man forgets to breathe. You feel that? Nah, I'm about to feel some emotions, all right. Remember, children, do not fear the unknown. We are the unknown. Show us, Amanda. I don't think Michael's up to this. Hmm. He may surprise you. Plank. Plank. Chaturanga. Chata. Yeah. Feel the flow. <laughs> Everything is flowing in me. Oh. Mike, would you? I hope there is time for yoga to save you. Breathing is almost the most important thing, no? Out with the breath. No vanity, come on. Breathe, please, Michael. When we met, he was actually limber. Take in the air and release it. Out through the mouth. Fabian's body with your bank account would be the perfect man. Your lungs, they work, yes? Good. Breathing is almost the most important thing, no? Out through the mouth. Can you thank us now for saving you from the couch? Breathe, please, Michael. Hold the anus. Take in the air and release it. Let it out. You're turning red. <laughs> you have come a long way today, Mikael. Huh? Yes, later you will cry like a baby. Yeah, right. His chakras are completely blocked. Don't worry about him. Show me the downward dog. I'm glad we have helped with your impotence, Mikael. What'd you say? Your sexual energies have been blocked for too long. Back into my pelvis. Back. What? Back, back. Yes, there you go. Oh, 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 oh! What? Hey, enough of that shit! Ah! Yoga is the answer, Mikhail. But what is the question? Uh, why am I such a moron? We are leaving and we are never coming back! Good! You are alone, you pathetic psychopath! Ugh, fuck you! And that phony French fucking yogi! Gah! Jimmy, you still here? James! Go away! Oh yeah, fuck you. You know what, if there was a rape- Talking in your ear. 
Nice TV. Did I pay for that? Yeah, you smashed the other one, didn't you? All right, come on. I want to go for a ride. I got to meet a friend. All right, so I'll go meet him with you. Come on, I want to get out of the house. I'm not going alone. Come on. This is fucking bullshit. Bullshit? Threatening to molest your online buddies is bullshit. They're not my buddies. They're the only people you speak to. So where's your friend? Burger shot. Yeah, nice to see the kids are still hanging out at the burger joints. Me and the guys, we'd go down to the diner after class every day. You know, get milkshakes, fries. No. Ew, please. You know, you're really creeping me out. I'm trying to relate to you. No, you're trying to take me on some nostalgia trip. You're such a cliche. Oh, says the dope-smoking, game-playing, live-at-home world owes him a living millennial. I knew it. I knew it. The mask was gonna slip. The monster's been exposed. The hell are you talking about? The real you. That bitter, vindictive old man. You pretend you're being a father, but you hate me, don't you? I don't hate you, Jim. How many times... I love you. Look. You really have to meet my friend? Yeah, I really do. There he is, the friendly neighborhood drug dealer. <laughs> Yo, oh, brother man, what's man? up? What's How up, you doing? man? Good to see you. What are you turning tricks to pay for this shit, huh? Hey, who's the old man? It's my dad. Oh, all right, Mr. DeSanto. <laughs> yeah, you the kid selling Jimmy pot by the pound? Ooh. <laughs> now, Jimmy, bro, your dad's funny, man. Come on, do this shit and let's get going. Oh, yeah, you, you got that other thing? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, man, what the fuck, Jimmy? Just, just hold on a second. Oh, all right. All right, later on. Careful man. with that. Hey, let's bounce. Bounce. We're bouncing now. Is that what we're doing? Jesus fucking Christ. All righty then. Now what? Can we just get back to the house, please? So, uh, want a drink? I'm driving. Because normally you're such a between-the-white-lines, friend-to-the-pedestrian kind of guy. Fine. Give it here. Okay, your turn. Maybe when we get home. Ah, who's the Shit! Who's the square now? <laughs> I'm starting to feel a little woozy. You're fine. No. I gotta stop. Oh, what was in that thing? It's harmless. Vets have been using it for decades. What? You anesthetize me? You I'll fuck this shit. You from yourself. Also, I took money from your bank account and I'm moving out. What? Right? You're too crazy, Dad. Come on. Get out Thank <laughs> you.
Jimmy, you little shit. Michael, I think you finally lost your mind. Your recent behavior and the company you've been keeping already had me very concerned. Now you've taken to attacking my Fabian, who is a close friend, and then Jimmy said you took drugs while driving him in your car. We've decided to move out for a while. You promised me you'd change, and you haven't changed a bit. I know you say I always act like I'm in a movie. Well, this isn't that. I think I'm gonna speak to a lawyer. I'm just really confused. Please, don't try to contact us and try not to get yourself killed. Amanda. I'd like to order a cab, please. I'm sending one out right now. Thank you. Where can I take you? You're through to Big J! Pillbox Hill. Let's go! Hey, we're here. Hey, Michael. David. Well, isn't this nice? You didn't tell me we were double dating. Sorry, guys. This bar and hunk of love is all mine. <laughs> Brilliant! <laughs> Steve Haynes, amigo, but you probably knew that already. Sorry, your name tag must have fallen off. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> duh! I love it! I, I, I gotta remember to write that down. <laughs> and to shoot you in your head, you annoying dick. <laughs> Andres, taking notes? This stuff? Whoa! Pure magic! They should put it on my show. 
Have you seen my show? You mean how to dress like a salesman on a cheap golf weekend at a third-rate country club? <laughs> so, well done with our, uh, our friend, Mr. K. My pleasure. Uh, I love helping our government wage war, especially with itself. But you made a mistake. Did I, Cupcake? Why don't you keep your fucking voice down before I close your fucking windpipe? The joke stops. You can't teach an old dog new tricks. Let's go. The Bureau owns a lot out in East LS. Covington Supplies off El Rancho. Can you take us there? Yeah, sure. Sounds nice and secluded. Kind of place you'd run an off-the-books operation, huh? So what? So I bet federal ain't on the deed, that's so. And we all like our federal government open and transparent. Except when closed and opaque suits you better. Hey, I'm just a puppet. You're the one pulling the strings. Tell me, Davey, you expense this ride to the taxpayer? Oh, I'm sorry about that. I didn't see you do that. Yeah. Ignore that, and concentrate on all the IAA agents we're gonna run into. I need you to don't. I need you to make a couple of calls. Get some people on board. First guy is Franklin Clinton. Hey, I barely know that kid. He's fixing up my car. Call him, or we'll send some G-men to his aunt's house. Okay. Okay. Mike, this ain't the best time. I'm kinda busy. Hey, sorry about that. Listen, you know that thing we talked about before? It's happening. I need you to come to a lot off El Rancho, not far from where we met before. All right, that's cool. I'm in LS anyway. Now, Trevor Phillips. Oh, you're crazy. I ain't calling him. I thought you might say that, so we had him picked up. That's a dumb move, Dave. Real fucking dumb. Just worry about the plan, okay? Getting Mr. K out of the IAA station. Clinton is going to be positioned across the street, keeping an eye on the proceedings. Phillips flies you in, you rappel down, make the extraction. And I'm the best guy you got for this. With you, we've got good leverage. Great! And you brought Trevor in. We're telling him I'm all cozy with the F5B. You'll need discreet support. We'll maintain... No more car accidents. We'll maintain control of the situation. You know what? You better keep a low profile. Yeah, I think I will. See you later. Who's that cagey motherfucker, huh? No, it's another cagey motherfucker, all right? Not you! Hey, T, enough with the faux political bullshit. <sighs> Franklin, come on, you better take off. Really. Shit, I'm good. I ain't bailed. Whoa. What, am I detecting some, uh, some sort of, uh, son I never had bullshit here, Mikey, huh? Hey, listen, if you want to replace some father figure, you can do a lot better than this fat snake, all right? This fucker would eat his own kids. Like I said, Franklin, deranged. Yeah, and best friend. <laughs> exactly. That's Trevor, my best friend. That's Franklin, the son I always wanted. <sighs> all right, guys, listen, this is the shot. I'm gonna do all the heavy lifting on this job, okay? Trevor, all I need you to do is fly me to the target. Franklin, you're gonna cover me from across the street. We're gonna make these assholes happy, and we're gonna walk away from this thing clean. Got it? I got you. All right. And we do this, and they help us bring Brad, right? Yeah. We'll talk about Brad later, all right? I gotta change. You better grab a head start. Nice to meet you, homie. Yeah, whatever. <sighs> The government gimp at last. Eh, yeah, bite me. Let's go. <sighs> All right, let's do this thing. We need to go to the agency headquarters downtown. Your new friends are a riot. No wonder you said sayonara to the old crew. Walking away ain't easy, Trev. But sometimes I guess you gotta make compromises. What happened to dying with a gun in your hand? Life happened. Annoying wife, two kids. Remember them? 
get tied down, you can't move anymore. What about your ties to me? To Brad? Those ties are why you got roped in on this FIB instigated suicide pact. I'm going in on the west side of the tower. Get us in position, I'll drop. You fuck around while I'm out there. I'll climb back up this rope and strangle you with it. Yeah. Next, I'll have this thing so far up your ass, your tonsils will be playing shadow puppets. You think we can't do that? We can. It's in our guidelines. I don't know what you're talking about. I install cinema equipment, not surveillance. Grab his other arm. No, 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 no. You think you're impenetrable? See how you feel with this is 18 inches deep inside. No. Get the lube. Actually, no, no. fuck the lube. Let's dry dock it. The, the world room. thinks you're dead, genius. <laughs> Who the fuck is this? Terminate him. Close this problem right now. Yeah, I can use a little backup here. Get me this station. 36 flow. I got you. Don't harm the asset. He's got support. Oh, don't, don't shoot me. No, 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 no! Hey, Hold on! We got a window, T! Pull us out! They're attracting the asset! I'm slipping! Shoot us across the street! Don't, don't, don't drop me! Don't, don't drop me! We cannot jump it up! T, we need to be... clear this building! The guy's shooting at you, Mikey! That's unfinished business! Clean it up! We'll move on, you damn softy! That's it! Get us out of here! Looks like we've attracted the attention of their air unit. You got a bogey coming at you, Franklin! I thought I had to be some job. Okay? I'm sure. Don't worry, they'll look after you. The things those people did to me. I'm an American citizen. Put her down in the lot, Trevor. Right, let's go. 
Where are we? Hey, go easy, hon. Thank you. Oh, you saved me. Hey, hey. No, huh? No, 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 no. Hey, hey, I said easy. Oh, oh, come on, give the no. guy a break. Uh. I'm gonna get out of this shit. Ha-ha! <laughs> In bed with the Bureau and a new running buddy. Yeah, he's more of a protege. Yeah, what, you gonna teach him to be old before his time? Yeah, to never grow up. That seems like a good kid. Huh? Michael, huh, look at this, huh? New city, new set of problems, but the idiots, uh, they stay the same. Yep, I guess. All right, Jerry, I'll see you later. Oh, you better believe it, buddy. The FIB Townley? Why does it not surprise me? Trevor is a... The Trevor... Trevor is a... Trevor is a what? Trevor uh, is a good guy. He's got family. Got kid, ain't he, Floyd? That, 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 that's it, right. Yes, Trevor. <laughs> but, but the thing is, um, I ain't been with that many women. I don't find it easy. And, um, and Deborah, I mean, we're getting married, so... Well, that's beautiful. But I'm scared that she's gonna leave me. I mean, this is her place. And the fornicating? There's... Come on then, Floyd, what you got for me? Like I said, I don't rightly know what we got. You're gonna have to be more... <laughs> more exact in your questioning, sir. Uh, we're looking for something to steal. Sir, I stole a pencil in elementary school and I've been regretting it ever since. Floyd always was a stick in the mud. Look, sir... Please, just tell me what you want, and I'll do my utmost to assist you in finding it. Here's the problem. 
I don't know what I want. It's a bit, well... Can you give me some porn in next time? Like pornography or a perfect turd. I can't quite describe it, but I'll know it when I see it. You ain't aiding my comprehension. All right, all right. Well, how's this? Two hundred and thirty-six billion dollars worth of cargo came through the port of Los Santos last year. He's real good with numbers. I don't want to hijack a truck full of pineapples, Floyd. You need to give us the inside track on what's coming through. We don't know what's in the containers. They certainly don't put price tags on them. Have you noticed anything? Anything different? Anything? Anything that might indicate something? Well, there's been all these uh, Meriwether folks hanging around. Meriwether security consultant. Private army to the New World Order. My butt's gone. The folks waging outsourced shadow wars in 20 countries around the globe and recently cleared to operate on U.S. soil. That, um, sounds like them. So there's a private militia in the port. What are they guarding? This one freighter? I guess now that you mention it, it ain't quite right. Go park and get the dispatch. No, yep, will do. <laughs> Go park and get the dispatch. Come on, shift's about to start. Hey! Here comes the suit. I gotta check in. Remember, Floyd, this can go real wrong real quick. We got a waste spillage and I got a slot on the cleanup crew. There is nothing that Wade here ain't gonna do for a warm meal. Hope you got a strong stomach, son. <laughs> Get in there. You gonna take me to see this freighter? Yeah, it's over here. You ever get it?
helicopters coming in and out of here? You know, those big sky crane things that could pick up a whole container? Now, this is restricted airspace. They won't let anything out of here without clearance. Shoot it down if they have to. So how's a man in a hurry supposed to get in and out of this place? Well, we got a port that stretched to 50 feet. Now, what's the Coast Guard response like? Well, they got cutters, 45-foot response vessels, air support. You're not gonna move much faster than them, especially if you're carrying something. Maybe I'll have to saddle you up and ride you across the Miriam Turner overpass. They ain't part of nothing. Government contract.